this video we will look at pattern memory and recall. Please subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to get notifications every time a new video is released. Now that we have covered all the patterns available to us, we will look at the function pattern memory and recall. Let's suppose we have a G-code pattern that repeats several times in a program. Instead of writing the same line multiple times, we can store a G-code pattern in memory and recall it as many times as we want. There are up to five memory slots and we can put a line in memory by placing the letter A and the memory number in the beginning of the G-code pattern line. To recall that pattern, we simply place a B with the memory slot on a line by itself. This function is available with any of the G-code patterns we have covered in previous videos. Let's look at an example. We see that we have the same bolt hole circle twice in the drawing. The only difference between the two circles of holes is the positioning on the sheet. We know that we will use the pattern G26 for this program but do we have to write the G26 twice since it is exactly the same? Not necessarily. Let's go to punch sim and write the program. G72 X12 Y12 which is the center of the first hole G26 I5 which is the radius of the circle J60 which is the angle of the first hole on the circle, K6, which is the total number of holes on the circle, T203, which is the station number, G72, X30, Y12, which is the center of the second circle. Now we could write the second G26 line exactly the same as the first one, or we could use a pattern memory. We can place the first G26 line in memory slot 1 by placing an A1 in front of the line. To recall it, we simply use B1. Let's simulate. We see the two circles of holes exactly the same as in the drawing. If you want more information on the PunchSim software, click on the link to visit cncsoft.com. Using pattern memory and recall saves us time from retyping the same lines and saves memory space in the machine control by making the program smaller in size. Remember, you can put a pattern line in memory using the A and the memory location. There are five memory locations, one to five. To recall it, use B and the same memory location. You can recall the same memory as many times as you need. If you need more than five memory locations, you can always redefine a location. In other words, once A1 has been recalled by B1 all the times we need, we can put another line in A1, and it will replace the previous pattern in that memory. Note that the pattern memory and recall functions are for patterns only. That covers pattern memory and recall. If you have any questions or comments, post them below or email us directly at support at cncsoft.com. See you soon in the next video as we continue our Punch Programming course series. Please subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to get notifications every time a new video is released.